Hey everyone, and welcome back to another eShop Deals video, where each and every week we go through all the games that are currently on sale on the Nintendo Switch eShop, and we pick out which are the best games for the week. Now just in case you're new to the channel or this series, quick reminder that I don't go over the games that were mentioned in last week's video. And since deals do sometimes last more than 7 days, it's always a good idea that you check out last week's video to make sure you're not missing out on any of the deals. As a side note, I also do a midweek update where I focus on all the games that are under $5. So if ever you're looking for the cheapest eShop deals, make sure to check out for that midweek update. And in reference to that video, we'll also be announcing today the winner of the $5 eShop gift card. If you want to participate for future weeks, all you need to do is check out the under $5 video and drop a comment there. Now we've got another great week of almost 30 games to look at, so let's get started. Just don't forget that if you do like the content, please hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Now we're going to start today's video with a whole series that is on sale and it is one of my personal favorites, the Dark Siders series. And this is the latest entry, Dark Siders Genesis, that is now 55% off at $17.99. Personally though, this is my least favorite of the three entries. However, if you get into the series, it is very important for the storyline. The reason why I did like this one a little bit less is that they shifted the perspective rather than being behind the player, you're playing in a top-down, almost Diablo-style view. This is mostly to accommodate the new character that is mostly based around shooting. It does work overall, but I did find that the puzzles were slightly diminished in this game, which was a part that I really liked from the other two Darksiders entries. Now next we have Darksiders 2 at 55% off, coming in a little cheaper at $13.49. Now in this second outing, you play as Death, one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse, in a 3D action adventure game. Think of a very dark Ocarina of Time from the Zelda series. It has a mix of puzzles and great action sequences. I really, really enjoyed this game a lot. Now lastly, we have Darksiders, the original entry, coming in with the same deal as Darksiders 2 at 55% off for $13.49. Now personally, this was my favorite outing of the whole series. However, a lot of people do say this is the one also that resembles the most a 3D Zelda game, although with a much darker perspective. My personal choice is because I really love the character of War, which is once again one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse, and I love his melee style of combat mixed with a little bit of shooting. Now next, we have a shout out from my under $5 video of this week. We have the Amnesia Collection at 90% off for $2.99. I'm re-mentioning this deal because I want to make sure that no one misses out on it because value-wise, it is probably one of the best pickups. You get three awesome horror games. Yes, some of them are starting to feel dated, but at only $3, this is a collection that I almost think everyone should have on their Switch, as long as you have any interest in the horror-like genre. And while we're on the topic of quick shoutouts, let's do another one really quick with Mark of the Ninja Remastered that is still 75% off at $4.99. Now this is a 2D action stealth game, and it is a very good one at that. Think Metal Gear Solid in a 2D format playing as a ninja. If any of that convinces you whatsoever, definitely pick this game up at $5. It is a steal. Now next on the list, we have Children of Morda that is back, but with a new lowest price ever of 60% off for $8.79. Now this is a rogue light dungeon crawler where you play as the members of a common family. And it is a really great game. On top of it, we keep getting free downloads to extend the gameplay. So if you're into the roguelike genre and you want a new entry to throw a little bit of time into, Children of Morda is one of the better ones on the Nintendo Switch, and at $8.79, it's once again a steal. Now next, we have the Trine Ultimate Collection that is at a ultimate low of $9.99 because it is 80% off, and in this collection, you get four great games. Honestly, the third one is maybe a down point of the series, but nonetheless, it is still way worth the $10. And the other three entries are among some of the best puzzle platformers you are going to get on the Switch. So all this for a $10 price point is a no-brainer. 
Now, next on the list, we have Shakedown Hawaii back at 60% off for $7.99. Now, think Grand Theft Auto 2 with its top-down perspective, but with some truly crazy gameplay. On top of it, this has also the background story of the fact that you're trying to set up a business and become a corporate empire. However, you're going to do it with some shady tactics, some protection money behind it, but nonetheless, this game is really tons of fun, and at $7.99, you are definitely going to get your money's worth. Now, next on the list, we have Okami HD back to 50% off for $9.99. Now, this is a 3D action adventure game with some solid mechanics and a very interesting storyline. However, what sets it apart are the stunning visuals, and the HD remaster has really brought it to another level. So if you enjoy this type of gameplay, definitely invest this week in Okami HD. Now next we're going to do one last shout out from the under $5 list this week with Blossom Tales at 75% off for $3.74. Another game that I had to re-mention here to make sure that no one misses out on it. This time think of a top-down Zelda game, sort of like an SNES era Link to the Past. However, I'll be honest with you, yes, the game is quite a bit shorter. However, at $3.74, it is amazing value, and if you need any more convincing for yourself, there's a free downloadable demo for this one. Now, next on the list, we have Crisis Remastered at 50% off for $14.99. Now, this is a great entry for any fans of FPS games. And at 50% off, this game is really worth the investment, especially the fact that the remaster we got on the Switch is truly very solid. On top of it, it finally answers the question I say it every time, can the Switch run Crisis? Well, yes, it can. Now next on the list, we have a game making a first entry to the series, simply because it rarely goes on sale, Two Point Hospital, the Jumbo Edition, at 30% off for $27.99. So in this, you get Two Point Hospital, and you get pretty much all the DLC included. Now, if you're into theme park builders, time management games, this is probably, in my opinion, the best one all around we have on the Switch. I actually own the physical edition to this game, and I play it on a regular, regular basis. So if you're looking for that type of gameplay, at $27.99, it rarely gets lower than this. Now next on the list we have Kingdoms of Amalur Re-Reckoning at 25% off for $29.99. Although this is a port of an older 3D action RPG set in a fantasy environment, it is still a very solid entry on the Switch. However, I did mention when the game came out that it probably wouldn't take too long for a sale to hit, and look we've already been hit with a 25% off. You could wait for a slightly bigger sale, but at least now at $29.99, it starts feeling like some pretty good value. Now, our next entry is going to be Ease 8 Lacrimosa of Dana at 66% off, hitting back to its lowest price of $19.99. Now, this is a great action RPG, part of an amazing series altogether. And if you are into action RPGs, you haven't played the Ease series yet, do yourself a favor, Pick them all up when they eventually fall on sale, because these are some truly great games. Now next on the list, we have another game that I love to talk about, Blue Fire, back to 40% off for $11.99. Now this game took me by surprise when it released, I wasn't expecting it to be as good as it was. Imagine a 3D Hollow Knight meets Souls-like combat, and you get a tiny version of what Blue Fire turns out to be, although much more focused on crazy platforming than it is on combat. If you enjoy this game, definitely check it out. I reviewed it on the channel, and at $11.99, it is a really nice pickup. Now next on the list, we have Chasm at 70% off for $5.99. Now this is a new entry to the series, I just tried out the game this week, and you know what, I was quite impressed. It's a 2D action adventure metroidvania with some RPG elements thrown in. This is a great game to pick up when it's on sale. I would say at its full price it is still a decent offering, but it really shines at this $6 price point. So now, just before we continue on with the list, it's time to announce this week's winner of the $5 eShop gift card. So this week's winner is going to be Kylie, who said, 
Blossom Tales is a nice little game. Love your $5 videos. They're so relaxing, the best thing is playing Switch and listening to you and all the deals. Would love to pick up Ukulele. Well, hopefully the $5 will help you do just that because Ukulele is a really great game. So all you need to do to claim your $5 eShop gift card is reach out in my pinned comment in this video down below. Now next on the list we have Raji and Ancient Epic at 50% off for $12.49. Another great action adventure game with some beautiful visuals and some really solid gameplay. However this is another one of those games that at its full price of $25 I had a hard time recommending. However, right now, at 50% off for $12.49, you do get a great experience. And this is another game this week that does have a free downloadable demo. Next, we have Wallachia Reign of Dracula at 40% off for $8.99. A great linear style 2D action platformer heavily inspired by the Castlevania series. With some really great fast paced action and a nice flip on the gameplay with your main weapon being a bow and arrow. Now next on the list we have Langrisser 1 and 2 at 50% off for $24.99. Now in this pack you get two great strategy RPGs. There's only one slight warning I'm going to give about this pack. These are some fairly old games that were reported to the Switch. Some of the storyline elements and the mechanics will feel slightly dated. However, if you do enjoy strategy RPGs, there is a lot to love in this collection. Now next, we have the SNK 40th Anniversary Collection at 50% off for $19.99. Now I know there's some people out there that will say that at $20, it is still expensive for a collection of retro games. But you know what? What I really like about this collection is it goes through all the eras of the SNK company and you also get a huge variety of gameplay types, going from shoot 'em ups to fighters, to side scrollers, to even beat em ups. It is a truly amazing collection, and if you enjoy retro gaming, it's a blast from the past. Now, next, we have the Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel 3 and 4 that are on sale this week. However, the top choice for this week, I would say, is the third one if you haven't played it yet. It is a better deal at 50% off for $29.99. Now, these are some full fledged, truly great JRPGs. If you haven't played this series yet and you're into JRPGs, do yourself a favor, get into it. However, start with the third one because the storylines do follow each other. And since this is the better deal for this week, I would pick up only the third one and hope for a better deal by the time you get to the fourth. And just as a quick mention, here let's take a couple of seconds to look at that fourth one. As I said, the deal isn't as sweet at only 20% off, leaving it at $47.99. I mean, it is still an amazing RPG. It's just that this week, if you only had to pick up one of the two, definitely start with the third. Since the storylines follow each other, you're better off doing it that way. Now next on the list we have Tanuki Justice at 40% off for $8.99. Now this is a 2D action platformer slash bullet hell where only one hit automatically kills you. I actually played this game on stream this week to show everyone just how amazing and at the same time difficult it is. If you're into difficult 2D side scrollers definitely give Tanuki Justice a shot. There's only six stages but trust me it's going to take tons of tries and memorization to get through this game. Next, we have Dandara, the Trials of Fear Edition, at 65% off for $5.24. Another great 2D Metroidvania on the Switch. However, as I normally say, at its full price of $14.99, there are better options out there. However, once again, at $5.24 for fans of Metroidvanias that want to try something a little different that can even sometimes use the touchscreen, Dandara is a great pickup. Next is a game that I was super excited to finally be able to talk about on the channel because it's finally discounted enough where I think it's worth a decent pickup. The Penny Punching Princess at 75% off for $9.99. Now this actually mixes RPG with a brawler. And it has the original concept where pretty much money buys you everything in this game. You can even buy your opponents to help you out. So it is a tons of fun with some really original mechanics However, at its $40 price point was definitely a game that I could not suggest to anyone. However, right now at $9.99, if you want to try out an original experience, 
Penny Punchy Princess could be a really great pickup. Now next we have a double pack that I'm pretty much going to mention every time it's on sale, just in case you don't have it yet. The Valfaris and Slain double pack, back to 65% off for $13.99. If you love hardcore 2D side scrollers, well you've got a great double pack here. Valfaris, which is a heavily shooting based 2D side scroller, and Slain, which is a melee combat side scroller, both tough as nails, but with some truly great soundtracks and amazing graphics and gameplay behind them. Now, while we're on that subject, there's another double pack that I'm always going to mention, the Onikin and Odalis double pack, also back to 75% off for $4.99. Now, I gave the warning last week when both games were on sale separately that the double pack normally follows it shortly after, and this is truly the best way to get these two classic retro styled RPGs. One being Castlevania style and the other one being a mix of sort of Ninja Gaiden and Strider. If you are a fan of 2D side scrollers, this is a pack that at $5 you have to pick up. Now we're going to end this week's list with one last great bundle that is on sale, the Pew Pew Bundle Volume 1 that is 85% off at $6.74. Basically, if you're into the shooter genre, you get one of all the main styles here. You get a great twin stick shooter in Xenoraptor. You get an amazing side scrolling space shooter in Black Paradox. And finally, you get a side scrolling action shooter with Bleed 2. And all three of these games are games that I would normally recommend all individually when they're on sale. So all packed together in a bundle for $6.74. This is a really great pickup. So that is pretty much it for our list of eShop deals for this week. I really find that we have a great mix of games this week and a little bit of everything for everyone. So as usual, I love hearing from all of you. So drop me down below in the comments what games you're picking up this week, what games maybe I would have missed and I should try for future weeks. Also, I want to take a couple of seconds to really thank the channel supporters. They're helping the channel out a bunch. You can see all their names in the credits of the video. And if you want any more information about those memberships, you can check out the link down below in the description of the video. And don't forget on the way out to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell so you know when all my future videos come out. And as usual, I hope I'll see all of you in my next video.